the loser here is him. But ho, 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 you can eat some turkey on Christmas Day at the county jail. Sheriff Grady Judd says the investigation into a Polk State College data breach led to a very disturbing discovery on a Winter Haven man's computer. Deputies arrested 38-year-old Brandon Diaz for hacking charges and possession of child pornography. News Channel 8's Justin Shecker live in the Tampa News Center tonight with the details on this and this investigation from the Sheriff's Office. Justin. In total, Jen and Keith, 38-year-old Brandon Diaz is facing 86 felony charges. Sheriff Grady Judd says he tampered with 10 accounts at Polk State College and collected dozens of disgusting child porn images on his computer. We've got a case here that you're just not going to believe. After losing his job at Lakeland Regional Health over a failed drug test, Sheriff Grady Judd says Polk State College terminated 38-year-old Brandon Diaz from his role in the EMS program. He decides that two of the instructors over at the Center for Public Safety were responsible for him losing his job. Sheriff Judd says Diaz decided to hack into the college's computer system in June and target those he felt were responsible for his firing. So Brandon sent information in, so when they reset the password, the message he sent to him was, ha, 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 loser. While serving a search warrant on his computer, Sheriff Judd says deputies discovered Diaz accessed very graphic images from the dark web. Voila! We filed, find child porn. Did you hear what I said? We found child porn. You can't make this up. The father, registered nurse, and former Polk County firefighter paramedic made his first appearance before a judge. I have reviewed two separate affidavits prior to coming into court. If convicted, Diaz could spend a very long time behind bars for his computer crimes. Here's a thought for you, Brandon. If you'd have just left everybody alone, at least for the time being, you'd be home for Christmas. And deputies say they did not find evidence of personal identity information being stolen. This investigation continues, and Sheriff Judd says it is possible they find even more images of child porn. The judge set the bond for Diaz at $386,000. Live in the Tampa News Center, I'm Justin Shecker, 8 on your side.